Hello. Have a, a neat Fuji secret for you. Um, while I obviously did report that there is this, there is high speed sync capability with the Nissan i40, Fuji X Pro 2, XT10, and XT1 up to one four thousandth of a second, and gave you demonstration the same. I found out via uh, diagnostic elimination that blocking all but center pin um, out from the uh, Fuji camera to uh, the Nissan uh, will block high-speed sync. And what does this mean ultimately? Well, the high-speed sync capability, uh, which I'll explain in a second, does exist uh, within the Nissan i40. The actual high-speed sync data for synchronizing that is coming resident from the Fuji X-T1, X-T10, and X-Pro2 that I tested today. And what that means is that Nikon, I mean, the Fuji Speedlight that is uh, coming out, uh, being announced uh, later this year and being built by METS for Fuji will have high speed sync capability. The firmware exists already in for flash communication and by the way the uh, pinouts on a Fuji are canon like for example if you want to use uh, you know uh, off-camera TTL sync cable you have to use a canon cable. Um, but yeah blocking all pinouts um, um, destroys the high speed sync capability and um, in the special uh, high speed sync uh, force on the Nissan i40 while that mode is within the system the actual data for communicating that the uh, speed light uh, initiate uh, burst mode and the way the high speed sync works is that uh, high speed sync data like in Nikon which is auto FP i.e. high speed sync it sends information to the speed light to start just before the curtains uh, rip, before they open, and then it actually pulses at a very high rate. And that's the same thing that actually happens on the Nissan i40 here, which you can use, and I tested at one four thousandth of a second on the X-T1, X-T10, and X-Pro2 today. Um, but that means that uh, the Fujis are already high speed sync capable. They are waiting for Fuji's release of that flash. It just happens that the Nissan i40, you know, beat them to that. And uh, this information can be found within the firmware script of the uh, XT1, X Pro 2, and uh, XT10. Any other Fuji cameras I don't know about, but that's good news. That means if you're waiting for uh, Fuji Speedlight, which is going to be released later this year, the news is good is that those are going to be high speed sync capable. And that's really good news because that data is being communicated to this unit to trip just prior to the shutter being released and to pulse until the shutter is closed. And it is not merely a trip that exists that initiates the high-speed sync as far as the forced high-speed sync on the Nissan i40. Rather, the information in conjunction is being sent by the Fuji camera to initiate high-speed sync rather than just fire. Like, for example, if I were to use like a, any old cable which has just a center pin connector, you can use any uh, flash cable with just a single center pin uh, connector, and this will fire, but it won't fire in high-speed sync. And uh, that's uh, that combined with, you know, the, the information that, uh, that uh, Fuji's coming out with a speed light later this year, not that that is telling of that, but rather what I've been able to deduce is that in short yeah getting to the point the uh, the Fuji Speedlight will be high speed sync capable um, I did also talk on another note so with a pocket wizard today and they did tell me which it's hundred and fifty six dollars that sits on top of uh, your Fuji is that the plus four transceiver is high speed sync capable with the Fuji system um, I'm going to get further details from them, but I kind of knew that about a month ago. But this information is new, and so that means that you can anticipate high-speed sync capability with the Fuji's next flash because the firmware is already existent within uh, the Fuji currently to initiate high-speed sync by eliminating out all but center pin connector where high-speed sync does not work on uh, this flash unit. So anyway, thanks for watching, and that's good news for Fuji shooters, and bye. Okay?